Good morning guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Shantae Marie here and I am a military lifestyle vlogger here on YouTube. If you guys are new, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Also, leave me a comment in the comments below. I love talking to you guys and just hanging out, having a chill, chill time on this platform. And I truly appreciate each and every one of you. So today I wanted to kind of talk a little bit more about my fitness journey, where it's at, where it's going, and I guess I can mention a little bit about where it has been. So if you guys did not watch my two videos ago now, I did a live video and it ended up being real emotional. I'll link it up here for you guys if you haven't seen it already, but I ended up making myself very upset just due to life experiences that have been happening and it, it ended up just being a little bit crazy but i wanted to come on here and tell you guys first of all thank you so much for your guys's concerns and reaching out to me whether it be in the comments or emails or just being an amazing people i received so much feedback from that video that i never expected and i really truly consider you guys my friends for me to be able to get on a platform and be that open and vulnerable with you guys and not feel like i was jeopardizing anything by talking about it with you it, it's amazing to know that you guys are that heartfelt and invested in what we have going on on this channel because i would not be able to make this content and feel like self-worth from what i'm doing if you guys didn't care as well so it means the world to me i wish i could hug each and every one of you but i wanted to let you know that i am in a better spot here over the past few days i've really come out of that funk kind of gotten over um just what i was feeling so I mentioned in the video how I worked out so much when I was deployed. I deployed 2013-2014 time frame and when I came back from that deployment I was still keeping up with the same kind of workout routine that I was doing but I was also jobless. So when you are working it is very hard to remain in this constant routine if that makes sense and the busier you get and the more activities you take on fitness sometimes can take a seat in the back and you end up the way that i am right now so i have gained 21 pounds i the last time i stepped on a scale a few weeks ago when i was sick i was weighing in at 171 pounds which is like shameful for me to say that's the biggest that I've ever been and I'm just I'm I'm mad at myself it's low-key embarrassing um, I measure in at like five seven for when it comes to APFT and PT test and my height weight so I would definitely have to get taped at this point because the max weight that I can be is like 160 pounds I think so I have a lot of work to do. I literally right now cannot even make it through two miles. I mean, I could for a PT test, I would suffer, but it's a struggle. I feel the weight when I work out. My knees hurt really bad. I have horrible knees to begin with, but my knees, my back, everything is just extremely sensitive because I am so much heavier than I was. And you guys are probably going to say like, girl, where are you going to, where are you going to lose 21 pounds? Like, where are you going to lose that at? Um, my curves, my butt, my boobs, uh, and a little bit on my stomach and my thighs are basically where all of the weight is kind of located. Um, I've also noticed that some of my tattoos are like different shapes now because of having gained just that little of weight. So I'm going to insert pictures so that you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Now, it's obviously very drastic. These are my before pictures that I just took the other day. It is a four-day weekend, so I have not been at the gym because I am going to be mapping out my meal plan. I'm going to be mapping out my workout routine, and I am going to put myself on a strict situation of what I am doing 
this takes extreme self-discipline and I it's something I've done before so I know that I have that discipline to do it and I want to take you guys with me I want you guys to be there every step of the way I want you guys to see the struggles the ups the downs being upset because maybe I didn't do as well as I wanted to do at the gym or I ate something that I feel like I shouldn't have had I want to share all of that with you and you guys made me feel so much better when we talked in my live stream and you said you want to see stuff like that here on my channel being in the military and everything that i show to you guys on my channel whether it's fitness whether it's family whether it's going on vacation or doing all these things as a military lifestyle vlogger vlogging my life is what i want you guys to see i want you to see that yes i can be in the military but i can still go out be with my friends, wear makeup, dress up. I can go to church. I can go on family vacations. I can do all of these things, work out, do whatever I do and still serve in the military. And that is what I want to share with you. So I am so excited for this journey. I will be sharing everything. I want you guys to make sure that you leave comments in the bottom of my videos. I love responding to you and talking to you about everything. And when there are videos you guys want me to see, let me know. Like, I am here for you guys. So, I am super excited to get started on this journey. And I am going to go so this video isn't ridiculously long. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. And like I said, if you're new, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Leave a comment in the bottom bar. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys.